Y'all heard the music. Y'all know y'all heard the music. You're like, girl, what you doing here? You was just here. I know, I'm back because things change just like that with the semi-annual sales, okay? So the ducks is coming in hot, y'all. Oh my goodness. We have another flash sale. Wallflowers are going for $2.50 tonight only. The sale has begun right now. So it's going on right now. What do you need to do? You need to click on that website if you want to go ahead and place your order and you get the wallflowers for a discounted price. If you ordered your wallflowers this morning, I believe you could call in and get your price adjusted after your order. I guess they should be able to do it. But since your order is in processing, I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know how that works. Um, but Y'all figure it out and let me know, okay? So if you don't follow Tiffany Glamorous, go follow her. My sis is the one who told me about this. Like, she sent it to me immediately. And I was like, girl, that means we got to make another video. She like, girl, yeah, you do. I'm like, girl, that the Body Works is already acting up. And the sale is just beginning. All these flash sales, $3.95, $4.95, all this stuff. Like, they are doing us good good online okay three wig chick just posted something that almost gave me a heart attack y'all i'm about to show y'all but if y'all don't check out three wig chick get her numbers up run them up run them up go check her out okay um i actually follow her as well if i tell y'all about people of course i'm following these people as well she is so down to earth and i really do enjoy her page she showed the new glass collection thing that's going to be coming out and when it came to that picture, even when Life Inside the Page Daily Find showed it, and I was talking to y'all about it last night, I said, watch this line. These candles is going to be either $28 or $29.50, somewhere in that range. Well, honey, the price is out, okay? The price is out. These candles are $29.50. You heard me right. I can't believe I'm saying this. These candles are going for $29.50. $29.50, like, wow. I mean, it is a beautiful candle. The glass jar is everything. But this price point is not, like, pink Prosecco frosting, okay? It's pink sugar buttercream, fresh blackberry shell Prosecco, and it's going for $29.50. <sighs> I would say definitely wait for a sale and wait for a sale when all candles are on sale. That way you can get this candle. When it comes out, it's not even officially launched yet. Just some stores have them out, okay? And they're going for regular price. Do not ever pay regular price for candles if you don't have to. Like, I don't recommend it um, unless you're an influencer and you just want them that bad. Now, one thing that might be making these price increase happen, Target Home Styles posted this today and has a wonderful point. These are some candles that a customer was returning. And I talked about this before, and this is a big problem. And yes, price of everything is going up. Price of wax, price of all this stuff is going up. Theft is going up, all kind of stuff. But what we can control is what we take back to the store. Look at these candles. To me, these candles belong in the empties video, okay? These candles belong in somebody's empties video, are getting recycled. These are being returned for new candles. It has to be a certain thing set in place after a certain amount burnt, we can no longer return these candles. Because this is not fair. And as an associate, I know it puts them in an awkward position to have to say, I'm sorry, Mr. Customer. You know, it looks like you you enjoyed this candle. It's burnt down quite a bit. Um, and after a certain point we cannot take this candle back and I really believe that I think after about one fourth down you know you know if it's going to vibe with your life or not you are not going to make it all the way down to that point and say oh I didn't like that no no oh you liked it that you liked it, it a whole lot and this helps prices go up so if you're a person that's doing that, please stop. I don't think it's nobody really that watches like me or that's really heavy in the Bath and Body Works because we own so much we can't even get through our candles. But people watch TikTokers and they watch stuff like this and YouTubers who empty candles on purpose just to return them back to the Bath and Body Works and call it a hack. And you know what you do? You heard it for the rest of us, especially for the people that really enjoy this life. 
You're hurting it for the rest of us. So when I see prices like $29.50 and I see stuff like this, it makes you say, well, what you want them to do? And I know every store has loss prevention. They have this, they have that. I understand. But come on, sometimes we need to be good humans. And no decent human would say this is okay to return back to a store and say, oh, I didn't like it. Girl, you loved it at this point, okay? And I want to give a big, big shout out to Ricky. Hey, Ricky. Some of his subscribers have been coming over here. He mentions me quite a few times. And I've mentioned Ricky quite a few times. But if you miss Ricky's Bath & Body Works semi-annual sale day one walkthrough, go check it out. It is everything. He went to Starbucks too. Hopefully he didn't confuse He didn't confuse people like I did, but... We'll talk about that in a video. But go check out Ricky. Go subscribe to his channel. Let him know I sent you. Go watch his video. He even found 75% off perfume. 75% off perfume. And the store was so nice. And wasn't even that many people in there. So he was able to shop all comfortable. So if y'all didn't catch Ricky's video, definitely go check out the video. Make sure you're subscribed to his channel. Let him know Tina Marie sent you and look at his prior videos too because he be on it and he be up to date on what you need to know with Bath and Body Works. Now, I had my video go out, me and my mama. You know, I had to ride out day one with mama. Okay, we went to the outlet because the outlet, I knew that's where I wanted to use my coupon. So if you missed the outlet video or maybe you're in the middle of watching it now and then you're like, oh, shoot, Kendall News Network came back. Well, um, definitely go and check this video out. And y'all won't watch it, but I confused the heck out of the Starbucks lady. Y'all tell me how y'all will order the drink. Because if I say the name of the drink, I'm, and I have to, I feel like at the end of the drink, I got to quickly say hot. So, you know, I want it hot. But then I can't drop the word hot, the, the word iced out the name because that's not in the name. Like the name say iced. Like, so now I'm confused on what to do. Now they confused and I'm confused. But what ain't confusing is them Bills. <laughs> Bills Mafia. We won the day. Sorry to the Patriots fans or whatever. But uh, you tried to take us out. You, you tried to have us on stretches today. But we still came through with that W. So congratulations to the Buffalo Bills for securing another win. Me and my mom was in the restaurant acting up with the Bills fans up in there. It was so much fun. We was at... Um, what was it? Wings up in Austin. Oh man, we had a good old time. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember, rate, comment, subscribe. What have you gotten so far at SAS? And if you make SAS videos, definitely let us know in the comments below. Go ahead and link your videos so I can start watching because I'm about to start watching. I'm tired of reporting for the day. I want to watch some videos. So let me know and I'll talk to you guys later. And, oh, oh yeah, I can't leave this out. And DJ, one time for the people that's about spending that money in the back. Play my music.